Hello, friends, and welcome to this week's live stream. Where's our table? I feel so exposed. <laughs> I'm just a person. I'm just a, a person. These are my legs. These are my legs. I. These are my legs. <laughs> um. Anyway, hello, everyone. I hope everyone had a good weekend. It ha it today's Monday. I feel like you're so far away right um, now. I know you're really far away, but I also <laughs> had a weird like crisis moment where I was like, a good Monday. It is Monday. Yeah. We um, streaming right It's Monday. Now. Yeah. It, today is Monday. Um, so thanks to any of you guys who are here on a different day. Hello, it's Monday. I there hope you guys people had a good weekend. And maybe for you somewhere else, it could be a Tuesday. Right. Maybe. Yes. Um, so as you guys saw in the thumbnail slash the title of this stream today, we are going to be ambulating around because <laughs> I just can't get over the fact that we're not blocked by a thing. I know, it's weird. Um, yeah, it is, yeah, I don't know what to do with my legs or my hands or anything like that. Um, but we're going to be decorating this tree. We have this fake white plastic tree. It's not flocked. It doesn't have like the coating no, of it, like the dust. No, it's just white plastic. We got one of those things a couple years ago and those things will wreck the room it's in. The flocked tree does have a good look, but it is awful. Clarifying, <laughs> flocked are the ones that look like they have snow on them. Yes. So this is just a like white on them. plastic tree. Yes. And then we have a bunch of awesome ornaments that are go going to go with it well. Yes. A lot of dark ornaments that are going to contrast heavily. I think we just told Carly we want kind of like a, not like a goth Christmas tree, right. but sort of like a branded Christmas tree, okay. on brand. Yes. So Carly got us a lot of different ornaments that we'll have fun putting on the tree. They're all over the ground. Um, so we have those. We have poles, because you guys are going to be help, helping us decorate this tree. And we also have things like mug of the day and shirt of the day. So should, should we jump in with those first? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Should we also give a quick update? Oh, we have do have a quick update about the next coming video, the upcoming video, as well as a... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah totally. Okay. So if you guys want to see a sneak peek of our next main channel video, yes. it was broadcasted slash premiered in the streamies last night. Yeah. I don't know exactly where it was in the streamies. I can't tell you, but here is some sneak peek footage of that video that you can, if you want to go watch the streamies, I think the link is in the description. Um, you can go check that out. Because I think the streamies this year, as it was last year, was like mostly all digital. So we like kind of sent in like a, a segment of us sort of yeah. like not presenting something, but presenting a sneak peek of this upcoming video. It's not going to go up this weekend. Hopefully next weekend, like right as a photo finish before we're, Christmas. We're aiming for a Christmas Eve upload. Or Christmas Day. We have <laughs> posted Christmas on Day. both days. We are aiming for Christmas what Eve. What else are you going to do on <laughs> Christmas besides watch a video? So yeah. that's what we're hoping to do. But yeah, we it's in the streaming. So if you want to have the audio with that, yeah. uh, Carly was so kind as to put that as B-roll. Yeah. Nice little background there. But that's a square one if you want to see the full horizontal version. Uh, we have like a quick little segment where Soft says like, hey, here's the upcoming video. And as you saw, Boba is heavily involved in that video. Yes. Um, and we were editing and writing that all weekend. Two long writing days in a row, actually. So it's nice to be standing for that, yeah. for that reason. Yes. Um, but the video is really fun. I was just, you know, there's a lot of Boba content. So I like have been just craving Boba. So this is, this tea that's in my hand is all milk. So it's kind of playing into that. So if you want to check that out, that's on the link below. Um, but in the meantime, Let's show them the mugs and then we'll start decorating the tree. Totally. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. All right, Ty, so you do, you go first. Okay, so mug of the day actually is a mug that was designed by our merch designer, Jordan, who's in the room. Um, but it's also, yeah, it was, uh, we have been taking your guys' requests for weird mugs. And, and we did more of that today, too. We did. We filmed yeah. some short form content with more of the ones that you guys have requested. And this one is stapler. So it's basically mug, a mug. Mm -hmm. But I guess it's LARPing or it's playing disguise, it's a stapler. Maybe just with like wearing like a bulletin board. Yeah. But I really like this one because it's um it's kinda like it doesn't fit on the mug, which yeah. I like it so much. It just wraps all the way around. We have a lot of mugs that wrap around things. We have, you know, Frog with a Knife. Do you have seen that short form one? This is a good Frog with a knife. Just repeat it all the way around. So good sort of like full coverage. Full coverage mugs. Uh, and then for my shirt of the day, I got Suck a Jump, which, you know, it's uh It's very foily. It there is very foily, it is very reflective. It looks like Shuck It Joan right now, I know. which is another on you know brand. I I feel like <laughs> I feel like a mug could be a good way to sneak in like a merch specific not merch a channel a live stream specific merch yes. item. So maybe we'll do a poll later on in the next few weeks about like what IP we should go with. Yes, Dude in Throne. Yes, Gordy. Yeah, Suck It Joan. It could be any. They're all winners. It could, be, it could yeah. be. I I'm still trying to get behind the mug club. Because we have a lot of mug ideas right now. They're all, oh, all, yeah, 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 like yeah. Mug club. Yeah. It just we, seems hard to like coordinate the actual like 
not the making of, I mean, making of the mugs, but just yeah. like the mechanics of like, you sign up for a subscription mug service. Yes. <laughs> I don't know if those exist. Yeah. <laughs> but it sounds like a winner to me. Okay, do you wanna see your shirt? Yeah, totally. Are you too warm in here right now? N well, I'm committed to wearing the sweatshirt. Right, okay. So I've committed, oh my God, my hair looks so orange. Ignore yeah. that. I literally look like a Halloween it's Gordy. broom. Yeah, you're a right. literal broom. Um, anyway, so um, two less good updates. Yes, because there is a request for Krusty update over here. Right, two yeah. less good updates. One is that based off of Tyler's parents' house's internet speeds, yes. it seems like our stream on the 28th might not be possible. Right. So we are maybe, un I know that originally in our like December schedule, we said that we were going to be able to stream on the 28th. I am not sure that's going to be the case. I feel like. I feel like we, the answer is probably no. <laughs> we were trying to make it work. We were trying to figure it out. We were getting your dad to do like the internet speed test he did and do stuff the internet like this. Speed test. Yeah, he um, did. But it, it's not looking, it's not looking like that'll work out. Either. Right. And then in terms of a crusty update, unfortunately, he's not doing well. Right. <laughs> um, I think that we've always told you guys like he's super old. He's super super old. You yeah. know, we've made lots of jokes about like he's ancient. He's an ancient street cat. But I think that it might be getting to be that time. Yes. So. He's just, he's very old. He's getting super older. Super old. And uh, so, you and know. And he sort of had like a, he was, he was a, he was, he was a goner in, in October. And then sort of everything after that has just been like a, what, what the frick is going on? Kind of like bonus time. Yeah. So, but I think that. I wish I had the tables like lean on it right yeah. now. Yeah. Uh, no, basically. <laughs> That's uh, true. I feel like I I just want to warn you guys that he's not doing to prepare excellent. yourselves. Well, we we told you guys about his visit recently to the <laughs> hospital where it was like we had to sign a waiver to get him out of there because they yes. were so sure he was a goner that day. That's and then true. In just, October, it, they were basically like, "Come to the come to the emergency vet." We're we're doing it right now. Right. And we were like, no, we want to take him home for a few hours and we like signed the papers. And he's kind of been just like cockroaching since then. You know, like he's like, ugh, ugh. he's actually, he's, he's but, been doing well in terms of eating and having he, a good that's time. True. But I think that just sort of his, he, we're ambulating today. His total ambulation is very low. He's sort of very sedentary. He's very frail. He's very skinny, um, but he is like enjoying the things in life that some animals enjoy, like eating and stuff. I so. think his mind is still happy and young, but his body is just older and older yes. and older. Yeah. So, yeah, we uh, we have done a little bit of like looking at old videos of Krusty in the last couple of days, as we've done some TikToks with him here and there, and there is a significant girth delta of Dude, his I size and forget. his ability to move he around. He literally yeah. he used to be like a muscular cat. I called him a pit bull. Yeah. Got him, like, a, and he also hit me in the face all the time. So yeah, that and makes like sense. yeah, he like <laughs> and now he's just all bone. Yeah. So you can like play the xylophone on him. So that's a general heads up. I know it's not a happy update, uh, but you know, uh, I think that the, the big context is that a couple weeks ago, you know, they said, hey, it's not gonna be a good day for you guys. We basically infused Krusty with uh, cold cut turkey. Yeah, yeah. And he uh, he bounced back. So, but like, I think that, that we're reaching to the, like I think sort of the limits of the 21 years here. And so, I think, yeah, yeah, every time we talk to a vet about it, because we have, um, we have actually multiple vets we've to see Krusty and we've talked to Krusty and they're always like, He's had a good run, like every time we talk to them. So I think that's where we're at. If this is helpful to you guys, I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing, but he's kind of a fan favorite at the vets. Yes. Uh, so they both know of him, which can't be great, <laughs> but they also like him. So he's everywhere he's gone, he's left a good impression. Um, but yeah, you know, I think the term is playing with house money. Um, in, you know, in general, I think really yeah. since he got off the street in 15, house money, booyah. There's coyotes, there were possums. Possums are gnarly. There are possums, there are raccoons around, and the dude is hung in there. So why don't we, you know, decorate Move the forward. tree so we don't, you know, keep <laughs> bumming everybody out. But we just want to give you guys a quick update. So, yeah. Okay. Should yes. we do the tree? Yes, you have. So, getting back onto the stream. We have this Christmas tree here that Carly got for us. Yes. Um, and we have a bunch of ornaments. So we have here, Allie's here with the, with the action cam. We can show off some ornaments. Well, I don't um, know how to, sh we'll just, kind of just by around. my feet. We start going in. Should we do the first initial pull? Foot cam. Foot cam. <laughs> <laughs> um, should we do the first initial poll to see what kind of lights and garlands you guys want yeah. on this thing? Because we have multiple light options, but they're cacophonic with each other. So yeah, we want to so do have, one set. We yeah. have white lights with white string or purple lights with green string. 
Um, apparently the purple lights are very strong, but we'll do either, whichever one you, you guys like. Yes. Yeah. So, um, and then, so do you want to... I'm going to set up the pole right now. Purple, purple lights or white lights? In coming, yes. And they have a couple garlands that... They both look good, but we uh, can see. I saw a quick chat from Santa Arts. No black tree. Well, we're going with the white tree because it's a good canvas for lots of black ornaments. So I, I think in nature, agreed. it's going to be like a black tree for that reason. Okay, here we go. I think that A, white trees what? are a little bit more common, oh, and B, Tyler's right that want. at least I don't Is blend it? in with it. I just kicked something. What are the two I don't blend in with it. It's white purple lights. or white. Uh, purple lights. It's purple lights or white lights, basically. Uh, the only preface I will give here is that when we had the purple lights out earlier, we thought they were semi-blinding. That's what I was <laughs> saying. I was saying, I was saying they were yeah. they were a blast of flavor. A little neon. You know those lights that cars have that are like almost like those like blue sheen lights that kind of just blind you as you're driving? Oh, yeah, yeah. They got a- High they got beams. A LED, LED, right? LED. Yeah. They're kind of got <laughs> like- What did I say? And I, I don't know. High, high beams <laughs> are when you just actually get blinded by the lights. <laughs> Um, dude, you know, here's the thing with our, our we have a we have a car that we have obviously. Well, we have a car, but we have anyway, a car. Um, and yeah. I can't control when the high beams go on it. I can turn on the high beams and then it chooses when it wants them to go on. So oh, there's does a lot it of sense other cars coming. Yeah, but like if there's yeah, a lot of street lights, it turns them off. I'm it's like, a, it's even like, no one's around. It's like a it's like a nanny car. Like it's like you're you're not seat belted, which is I mean good, but like you're like you're yeah. not seat belted. Oh, yeah. there's someone else coming. Wait, pause. That's it does totally, all these things. Yeah, it does yeah, all those it does, things. Yeah. It doesn't, I think there are versions of it that will tell you when you're not looking at the road, which is hardcore. Oh yeah, I'm, they'll like face the recognize you. Okay. okay, so here are some ornaments. Oh, here we go. So uh, purple is running away with this thing, 75 to 75. <laughs> yeah. P.S. I might have broken all of our ornaments already. I'm a massive lightweight when it comes to everything booze related, and we did just film a short form thing. Oh, when, wow. I took, when I took oh, wow. a sip of a extremely disturbing drink that nobody in the room besides, well actually Jordan tried it, and I thought Jordan was gonna like it, but she said it was revolting. Yeah. Revolting is the word. Okay, so I had a sip of that too. Um, I took a second sip. Jordan also took a second sip. Yeah. So it was it, it, it was awful. Yeah. So if I seem at all, you know, are you streaming under the influence right now? A little bit. Yeah. One <laughs> sip deep. I have a placebo thing with everything though. Okay. So uh, purple's running like, away with it. Two thousand votes for and seventy-five percent to purple. So purple. There we go. Yeah. It's purple. That's good. I think that's good. Yeah. It's good. Okay. So All right, so we have to start at the top. Do you know how to do this, Tyler? Um, Here. In principle, yeah. But put, put the stapler down. It's not. Let's string around. It's not that easy to string your lights. We, 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 the best way to do it is when you have like newspaper and you wrap it around newspaper. So that way you can like, you know, wrap as you go. What? You, I've never heard that ever in my done life. that? Where you have the newspaper as like the bat baton that you go around. Oh. Here. No. You just, yeah. just pass it. Yeah. I, know, I get what you're saying, but I've never <laughs> yeah. done that. We've done a lot of. Hold on, grab the grab the bottom. You, you just get a, yeah, <laughs> just grab it as a ball. It's just a method to ball it, essentially. Yeah. I didn't think about that. I was like, just let's just snake it around. Yeah, you can snake it. We have such an impressive array right now of ornaments already. I think that the lights were, you know, let's just the pole. It's just a secondary thing. Am I'm I not doing going. a good job already. No. Am I gonna get criticized for my light stringing technique? You might. Probably. You, you, yeah, you, you probably Honestly, will. probably. Yeah. I feel like this is like along the lines of our discussion from last week when it comes to hair. Things like this, this kind of motion with my hands, I hate. I can't do it. You do you know? think this is the same as braiding hair? It, it's in the same arena, we right? We can it's go like, more, because I actually have more purple light, so we can oh. be like more... You want to go more dense? I don't we know could be more dense. dense. We don't have to go more dense, huh? just every other branch, really. That kind of thing. Yeah. We might still want a second one. Okay. Yeah. Just to reach in life. Yeah. All right, here we go. Go. Hey, kind of match your shirt. Thanks. Matches the, uh, the melting hands. Oh, I'm gonna end this poll actually, guys. Um, so yeah, ran away with it. Let's see here. Lower the music. Is the music a little loud? Is what they're saying. Can I we can do that on the fly? I can lower it. Bring it down. What song is I kind of liked currently? it. I kind of liked it loud. Yeah. I but know. I'm not listening to it, so <laughs> <laughs> that's not. <laughs> I am not currently here. Let's make it a little bit denser, Ty. You want to make it denser? Yeah, because we have a lot of light, so we might as well just do it. Well, it's kind of like in our videos, we have background music. It's usually pretty loud. Pretty loud. Yeah. But it also has like other mixing effects and stuff that we can use on it. Versus this just true. Maybe I'm not being talking. loud enough. Maybe I need to talk yeah, about it. Yeah, why don't you articulate? Just scream? No, articulate. It could have just been the song that played. What song was it? Joy to the World. Joy to the World. <laughs> Maybe a little bit too exciting. Get this joy to the world out of my ears. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, my mom's name is Joy, so when she would walk into places during Christmas time, people would say, Joy to the world, you know? Aww. Yeah, there you go, 90s boomer humor. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, me and I are 90s boomers. 
<laughs> yeah, you guys laughed at it. Yeah, um, cool. Uh, here, tie, here, tie. Oh, oh, you know what, though? This is good. We're doing this. When we get a chance, I want to show everyone the giveaway box because the giveaway box oh, is yeah. awesome. Yeah. Well, um, it's one of those things where, like, um, Jordan drew a bunch of stuff for the, the Frank and Soap giveaway box, and it's really cute. Yes. But it's only going to like 50 people. Yes. And they're like, how can we repurpose this box? Right. <laughs> what can we do with this box? And yeah, they're very cool. They yeah. have like All a right, lot so of Ty, you have the butt, right? right? Yeah, give, me Here the, comes, give me the the other things. Here comes a second round of lights. Yes. Give yeah. Me. Yes. Yeah. This side, right? Yep. Or you're just gonna take it. Just take it. Okay. Plugging it in. Okay. This is a lot of uh, physical like a Lego. action for a stream. This is hard. I feel like a Lego. Yeah. I think this is this and the this garland. This is the hardest part. This and the garland are going to be yeah. the hardest parts for sure. Well, that's, that is, I think, the way it is always with like a Christmas tree, right? The payoff is the ornaments. No one wants to do stringing the lights. That's true. Yeah. Uh, I see chat. What do you guys got for us? Wow, interesting. Um, Paranoia Princess says, your mom <laughs> may be Joy, Just but my grandma is Joan, so don't be offended by my shirt. I don't know if oh, that pfft. is it. <laughs> We're not Sick referring grandma. to your grandmother. We're referring to Joan of Arc. Yes, the Joan Much of Arc. Much less offensive. Yeah. yeah. Here, Ty. The saint, Joan of Arc. <laughs> is Joan of Arc technically a saint? I feel like I look so awkward right now because I'm just dragging. <laughs> I'm like dragging my wired mic around. <laughs> hey, Saf, I think that we're I think we're low enough here that you can just go in with the plug-in now if you want to. Yeah? Yeah, when you go over there. Can you make it a little tauter? Can we get me a guitar? Yeah, because okay. the up, the ones up here look a little bit less. Actually, do one. Well, I can't can't tell. I I think that we're good. Give me one more round. One more round. Yeah. I passed me the ball. Where? Oh. Are we still playing bingo bingo board world, or is there a new bingo board every week? I don't. There's. I didn't post a new bingo board to the community tab, but there is that service that I kind of forgot to investigate. Right. Just because read that clip from the streamies, that particular video, like the full video, has really been kicking our ass. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we spent all weekend basically like sifting through the footage and like writing the narration to make it make sense. Yeah. Because it was basically two straight days where I'm like a complete noob at making boba tea, have to learn every step of it. And yeah. then the second day we ran the shop for a day, like a bunch of people showed up and we um, we made drinks for them. We have so eight it, hours of footage on the second day alone and we have like And it's just mostly from cameras. my GoPro. So it's yeah. just like- It's nuts. I think you guys will really enjoy it though. It's, it's a really fun video. Also, there's gonna be a lot of our butts in this video. Why are so. people saying that my butt was there? No, actually not. Only one person said but. And I was like, that is true. <laughs> this is going to be a lot of tuckus in this video. Yeah. Oh! Oh, it looks cute. We didn't have a, a successful unveiling of this Christmas ah. tree. Ah! All right. All right. <laughs> Ready? Ready? Let's light this thing. Like Rockefeller Center, right? Three, <laughs> two, one, and there you go. Boom! Dude, it oh, the purple good. looks great. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love that purple, great. actually. That's a good color. <laughs> it's not white. It, it's got a good Thanos purple to it. Is that where your mind went first? No, yeah, like in uh, Infinity War, they have like this like this power stone and it's like this color purple. And if you grab it, you blow up. Yeah. Love it. There you go. Love There's it. our daily dosage of Marvel references. Okay, hot butts is what Miss Linus says. Hot so butts? Thank you. I, it was a hidden chat. I've now revealed it to everybody. So. Oh, yeah. you let that through, hot <laughs> yeah. butts? Yeah, well, Tithing? Super Boobs 890, which I just read, realized the name is <laughs> that, <laughs> posted three consecutive um, uh, eggplant emojis. Because it does oh, have wow. that, that color too. It's like, oh, we have a giant eggplant. The entire stream is demonetized. They go, what was with the giant phallic symbol? By the way, thanks for the streamies plug. I guess you just started to face YouTube with a giant phallus in the middle of it. You go, yeah, oh, I like how we say, stream, yeah, go watch the streamies, yes. then just footage of our butts. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so you have a Suck at Joan shirt, okay? You offended someone's grandmother. Okay, <laughs> secondarily, just a giant purple phallus. Okay, well, I listen. think that looks, it's not perfect, but it's pretty good. It's good enough for a live stream. Great. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's good enough uh, for you, fools. <laughs> um, all okay. right, so then show us the garlands, Ty. Yeah. Garlands. Oh, we have two garlands here. Are we doing the garlands too? Wrapping them around first. Well, I'm so anxious to get into the. Uh, we should do garlands, garlands. Okay, I fine. think, because if you don't want to cover an ornament oh. up, you want to put the ornaments. God, the wrapping just I can't, I can't do okay, it. This is the last thing you have to wrap. Okay, I'm gonna ask show you guys us, what you want. Show silver. us the two ones. Okay, give me a silver. Or Will you what? show? What? Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, um, what? here we go. Yeah, maybe I can hold this, them. Maybe this is almost like a Beetlejuice moment because we have here a semi-holographic one, right? 
Is it trying to all... summon Christine and Ben? Yeah, I'm trying to summon Christine and Ben so we you get that bingo really board going. You can't see that it's hollow from you afar. You There's think? a black garland right and, there. oh yeah, and a silver garland. You can see that hollow right there. You know? Black or silver. Yes, okay, let me see. Let me write, let me... Unforge um, for what color Phantom or... Christine. I kind of think the black one might look better, but I won't say anything. We could possibly do both, but it might be a lot. No, we're not doing both. No, we're not doing both. Not... Never mind, that's not an option. <laughs> All right, in the meantime, as you guys vote for a minute, I want to show you guys our uh, giveaway box. For the Frank and Soap giveaway, we have these little boxes that we uh, had, that Jordan whipped up, and then also had made. These are cool. Um, they have a bunch of little designs that we've been sort of like bouncing around for our merch, but also some stuff you guys will recognize, like Dude and Throne, and Suck It Joan, and a pink devil emoji. And I know everyone wants me to talk about this. This is Bulldozer. <laughs> As you guys know, Bulldozer is um, <laughs> Allie and Jordan's uh, co-raised uh, hamster, right? So Bulldozer is Wait, now- come back, come back to the little yeah. Bulldozer. See, yeah. my idea here, and this is what I've been pitching, yeah. is for him to have like a tiny pistol right. instead of a seed in his hands. Yeah. So he's just like a little gangster. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'd like. Well, there but. was a version of the 22 Jump Street uh, poster that was made where uh, I believe Bulldozer was riding on Channing Tatum's shoulder. Yeah, that's what I said. As the I said, third member of the I crew. I said he yeah. looked like he's from 21 Jump Street. That's uh, what I said. Yeah. Oh, the, yeah. Krusty was, there's, there's one here. This is also, this is uh, the, like, our semi-stolen from Rip and Dip, um, crusty sort of Lord Normal, who's in this this dumpster here. Let's see if we want to see here. Because there's a dumpster on the side of the box, and you might be wondering why would there be a dumpster on the side of the box, but if look you look carefully, uh, Dingus is in there. So yeah, he's hanging out there, right? And Little then sweetie. we have a bunch of good stuff. We have a Franken candle. Um, yeah, and then we have a Hello Friends and we have a snake wrapped itself around a lipstick. So these things are cool. I really like these boxes and they got a lot of good stuff. We're gonna and figure out something to do with these. <laughs> oh yeah, there's the sil crusty silhouette. You can yeah. see with his messed up ear. Yeah, the, the ear is the key. Any th it's like when you see like a, you know, uh, Prince Zuko impersonator, and they have their scar on the wrong side. Right? Any <laughs> impersonator crusty iconography that does not have the, the the missing year is not real. Okay. Anyway, uh, let's see what the chat says. The chat has run away with black socks. Okay. Yeah. Seventy three percent. I kind of, of agree. Un unfortunately, I think that it just looks it looks cooler. And I'm seeing some hollow Christine. So my whole Beetlejuice hypothesis was proven correct. Or maybe they're also doing that, where they're like, if I say hollow Christine, she'll appear. Which is, no, yeah, Christine right. is in the chat. <laughs> ah. Oh, sorry, Christine. <laughs> hollow was outvoted. Yeah. But to be fair, as we said, it was not a popping oh, hollow. Oh. Actually, I think the hollow really wouldn't work that well oh. on this tree. Do you need a second hand for the garlands? Honestly? Yes, probably. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say no. Yes. Okay. But that looks not the worst. That as I'm doing it, I'm blindly doing it this way, but I can see on the monitor it looks pretty good. Uh, I, I'm just reading Mod Holly's chat. They say, lol, Jordan, that got block blocked. I'm crying. I think that you said something that was blocked. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> here, yes. here, Ty. Go, go, go. Yes. Great. Oh! Yes. That's like the second time I almost shattered every ornament okay, that listen. we have. I was completely um, boycotting the black garland, or like any garland, frankly, but I think it's actually adding something to it. It looks you pretty You were just cool. trying to skip the garland. No, it looks, it, now we're, we're entering that nightmare before Christmas world. Yeah. Right? This could exist there. Oh, I made it worse. Yeah. Will you try and make it more... Uh, it, yeah. I see, made that's, it worse. see, that's not your fault, off. That's the that's the chaos theory at play when it comes to Christmas decorations. Like, it's just any attempt to rein in these evergreens is just going to lead to that kind the, of stuff. These evergreens, this yeah. one, I plastic evergreen. I don't like wrapping things. Okay. Anyway, okay. 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 And maybe. Wait, wait. Laura Austin says, "Who calls it a garland? Is that what you call these things?" Like tinsel. Tinsel. Never mind. <laughs> is it tinsel? Why did I think it was a garland? I called it tinsel garland. Tinsel, tinsel garland. garland. Okay. <laughs> Carly has spoken. It's both. Okay. <laughs> I think it's made out of tinsel. Tinsel people, you could be happy, and garland people. I think that wreath, <laughs> wreath could be something. A wreath is like a the, the round a thing that you put on the front of your door. Okay. So, <laughs> all right. With that on, let's go into the copious. Is copious the right word? The many, oh many ornaments that we have all over the ground. We have a lot of really great ones here. Where should we start today? Because we have some stream custom ones over here. I think here, that, let's start Jordan, with, you whip these ones up over here? Let's start with the like, let's start with the like large quantity of sort of like the black baubles. Okay. And then we'll go into the more specialty ones. Okay. I think, you know, if that makes sense? Yes, let's do it. So I have a bunch here that are su super cute. I love these ones. Just like little, these ones, these are like just plain black balls. 
I know everyone's currently bats. debating right now about whether or not it's garland or tinsel, and I just can't really get a feel what's going on in the chat. I think Some I've had three caffeinated drinks and my alcoholic one. Here's like a moon, yeah. skull moon, that's upside down. These ones are great, actually. These ones. So why don't we start with these, Ty? Right, these. Do you and also I have some that are like spider webby, also? Hey, can I get these bats in play too? Yeah. Oh, show right. us the bats. Why don't you have? Why don't you handle oh, the baubles, and I'll handle these bats because we have bats over here. Here, I can come into your frame, Allie, if you want. That makes it easier. So we got these guys, which I think. Look at them. We also bats. have some Cthulhu's. adorable. Some Cthulhu's. <laughs> oh, you have Cthulhu's? Yeah. Dark Lord, getting on there. I think the theming is strong. I, I like that they make these. I feel like uh, there's a lot of um, uh, love in the, the hearts of the, the Earth's people for Cthulhu, I feel like. I think people like Cthulhu, <laughs> despite his, his I you agree, know, I think people like him. <laughs> his bringing of certain destruction. Okay, I'm going down. Yep. Okay, so how do we do this? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm, really I'm fine. Did you just wipe out? Yeah. <laughs> It's like the third time I've wiped out. Yeah, what happened? This is there? why I usually don't. I'm usually, yeah. You don't decorate trees. Yeah. Uh, okay. Do you, is the is your mic? Yeah, okay. Safi, you're just getting second degree drunk. Okay. Yeah. Just from the existence of that gnarly. Any better? Bloody yeah. Mary cocktail. Yeah. Has it been bad for a while, or did it just? No, it's fell? just when you fell. I was like, it sounded like you were underwater. <laughs> like, was, <laughs> you mean Cthulhu is sucking <laughs> Sophia's spirit down into the depths of the Mariana Trench? Yeah, I just went down to Davy Jones' locker. <laughs> See you later, bye. Yes. See okay. you later, bye. Uh, I don't have that much variation over here. I just have these bats. And I don't know, I think I don't, I don't It's a little spider web. That is pretty cute. Meh. This reminds me of our Franken wedding cake we made, I think like all the way two years Actually, ago. Actually, it's about the same size. Yes. <laughs> so it's about the same height. It's sturdier though. Um, it's not just endlessly falling over as we wait for Rosanna to make it over to our east side house. That was that was a, a really... Um, it, is that a deep cut reference? I don't think so. The video is very long, so I don't know if everyone's seen that far into it. Basically, it if you guys great... don't know, uh, we made a Franken wedding cake that had every, you know. Nail biting, that's what I was trying to say. A nail, nail biting, biting moment. Yep. Every cake flavor you could think of, there was 48 of them and they were stacked on top of each other. And we made it, we frosted it, and we wanted Rosanna Pansino, who was a baking expert, to come by and taste it with us. Yeah, evaluate and, our yeah. work. And Rosanna was like, called, like FaceTimed us, and she was like, hey, I'm about like seven minutes away. And we're like, Rosanna, I don't think you understand. It is falling over currently. <laughs> and it was just like standing right there, but Rosanna did make it in Yeah, time. I kind of had like a finger on the side the whole time. Yes, it was gnarly, yeah. Ty, let uh, me put this front and center. You want front and center? A little bat. A little bat guy. That was here. really cute. Can you guys see that? These things are great. Oh, yeah. Oh, the action cam looks really good, actually. Yeah. It's the nice purple. and focused. Yes. <laughs> the purple's really doing it for me. I think the purple is the right call, chat. Yeah. The 75% were correct on that one. Um, should we introduce another variety of ornaments over here, Soph? Because I, I can't just put bats everywhere. You want Cthulhu's? Yeah, throw me Cthulhu. How do you, first of all, is how it, do you I say it? I think it might be Cthulhu. No, I think you were right. Cthulhu? I look like a frog. Yeah. Um, you think okay. you might be? I think you might be right. And also, what is he? Uh, it's, is it? Is he like a giant squid? Is it like a? It's a Lovecraftian monster. I don't know. But he's like an author who's. Or, this means it, a really the, big monster, right? Yeah, but there might also be legitimate lore where like Cthulhu is like a. He's essentially a kaiju, and that at some point, what, what is bulldozer doing over there? <laughs> oh my god! I think that uh, Jordan is sharing with us his big screen appearance in 23 Jump Street, <laughs> goes to pet school. I was worried he was on FaceTime or something. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> no, I was like what's happening Harley was there? worried. I was. No, I was. <laughs> yes, exactly. Wait, but what is Cthulhu? Cthulhu? <laughs> He's what like he? a, you know, like a world ender. Right, he, like, I think he would come and destroy the world, yeah. Got it. Yeah. And he lives in the bottom of the ocean. It's like, there's like this famous oh. like Reddit story called like The Plop or oh. something about some super loud noise that existed at the bottom of the ocean. And like to this day, scientists don't know what it was. And people hypothesize that that was Cthulhu. Somehow it's not real, obviously. It's a creepy th These all are broken. I, are they? Yeah. I think the chap believes it's Cthulhu. Cthulhu. It's Cthulhu. Okay. All right, we'll go with that. But who knows? <laughs> We usually defer to them. Yeah. You, you guys, guys tell us. Yeah, you guys are right. Yeah. That one's really cute. I Look really. At him. <laughs> this guy's cute. Yeah. He is cute. I like him. Um, cool. I think we have some. So that's pretty good. So we have bat baubles, bat so bats, bats, and then we have Cthulhu. 
And then we have some extra ones coming in here. Let's see. The bloop. Thank you. I feel heard. Is it the bloop or are you guys, are you guys teasing my... This time of year is always just so crazy. I'm always just like so freaking tired the whole time. Yeah, I was just telling my mom about that. Every single December is just editing, early nights, like scrambling to get it done before Christmas. Like did we, yeah. we told that story because we posted our melting every candle from Bath and Body Works video, uh, video to, uh, on Christmas Eve morning, but we posted it 10 minutes after our Uber to fly us home arrived. So we had to cancel our flight because so we, we didn't flight. make yeah. a flight. And we had a red eye in for Christmas. And I ate a burger that day from McDonald's that gave me food poisoning as I got onto the plane. Like literally as we were taking the Uber into so Tyler LAX, I was like Christmas. cold sweating as it was getting in. I missed Christmas day. Yeah. Yeah. It was not my finest moment. I like this little bat. You know what? There's this one coffee shop nearby in Raleigh. It only plays the depressing Christmas songs. Right. It's only like, have yourself a merry little Christmas. I'll be home for Christmas. I'm like, can you switch it up? <laughs> you, you just give me all I want for Christmas or something positive here? <laughs> Imagine you know? working there though. <laughs> My favorite, honestly, is do you hear what I hear? I love its hokiness, man. What's and, the one that has a really long intro? Oh, I have a theory that no one can ever guess which Christmas song it is when they hear Michael Bublé's version of it, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Yeah. Because they just play like swelling violin music. It's a and, super long intro. And then it just stops and goes, It's beginning to look a <laughs> lot like this song. <laughs> really? It could have been anything. It could be anything. Yeah. So that's what I do to soften when we're like working really late nights around the holidays is I like, I play like, what, what Christmas song? What, what, what Christmas song is this? <laughs> Start playing it. Okay, let's see, chat. What do you guys have? That's what I like about the fake trees is you can just bend the ends yeah, of it yeah. to like keep the ornament from falling off. Yeah. Okay, so we start introducing some other ornament families, Sophia. Are people tired of these? No, I'm tired of these. Okay, okay. so <laughs> this box is great. Show right. me that box. This one? This one's got some goodies in it. Show us. All right. I can't see them. All right, so in this but box, well, let me, let me, let me. Talk. Take some out, maybe. Let me, yeah, so. <laughs> I was like, maybe we should just show them all. Yeah. Okay, here. In this box, we have, I think that these things that we've really taken a liking, liking to, which are these gnomes. <laughs> They're, uh, wait, hold on, wait, can you see them? Oh, I'll cover this up at Joan. I feel like that's throwing off the exposure. These little gnome guys, we have these ones. We have a couple of them, actually, and they're sort of in holiday fashion. I saw, because we did a TikTok about the, uh, what's it called? The, the it's the Christmas trees around the world exhibit at the Museum of Science and Industry. We got a couple of these Disney oh ones my God, over here. What? Why are those so cute and tiny? I got a tiny Pluto. Well, I got more in here. They're all pretty good. I don't know if these are erasers or if they're ornaments, but yeah, they do this like Christmas trees, Christmas tree slash like holiday decorations from around the world. And I noticed people who are Scandinavian calling them something different. They're not called gnomes. We got some bats too. So we got a lot of varieties of bats. By the way, guys, I'm going to start sweating soon because I'm already sweating. I like this room. I have a light just on my face. Yeah. Um, right. Also, our tree toppers in there, but we should probably do that last. Tree toppers coming out later. Yeah. All right, give uh, me some gnomes. Here's a gnome. Here's a gnome. That's a gnome. Everyone gets a gnome. Yeah. All right. Where's a good place for the gnome here? Honestly, anywhere. I feel like if we put the gnome, this gnome. I next like the to splash Cthulhu. of orange. I'm gonna put them next to Cthulhu. You know, like they could be buddies together. Right? They could be friends. Yeah. <laughs> They're just two little dudes. Yeah. Having a grand old time. Extreme differences in sizes. Usually mm -hmm. gnomes are small. Cthulhu is multiple stories of buildings, right? So then them together, it kind of has a nice poetry. Okay, chat, what do you guys got over here? I love Christmas gnomes. Thank you. So people do call, oh, gonks? Gonks is what they call them. But you know what? I'm pretty easy to put here, because it was just the first yeah, one I saw. Let's, let's yeah, let's leave the the terminology and pronunciation to some Scandinavians. I yes. don't want to mess it up. <laughs> you don't want to get roasted by your Scandi brethren. <laughs> Just, yeah. <laughs> here we go. And then also over here, we have these these black skulls. This guy is oh, cute. Oh, that's so cute. You might have to put your hand behind it. Okay, let me see. What do you think? Oh yeah, look at that oh! skull. Okay, wait, Christmas while you're hat. there, and then look at this little, oh, it's a bat. With a bow of holly. Hold on, real quick. Look at this, because he has a little hat on. This guy <gasps> looks exactly like. Oh my god, he might be the mold. We might he have this mold. We have this mold, I believe, for our soap and beds. Yeah. It is the same. Because these feel like clay. Yeah. Yeah, these are the same ones. Yeah. And these, we actually we messed this up last year because we did something with them where they or, or there's like a sheen one and a matte one. Right. There is. And that one is good. Yeah. Cool. 
Most of these ornaments are ornaments that Carly curated for us. Yeah, Carly's killing so it right now. So that's why we've seemed so surprised. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, yeah. I really, I, I, I'm, should I put some on the back? You wanna put some on the back? No, well, no, no, no one's getting, no one's seeing back there. I just want to use, I just want to use as many ornaments as possible. Oh, you're... And this will, this is going to be our, like, office Christmas tree after this. That is true. We're going to have to figure out some way to move this out I of here. I was wondering that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, guys, so all the streams the rest of you are canceled because the Christmas tree's just in the way, so... <laughs> we'll just do it around the tree. You know what, I saw Matt, I, I saw Ben and Christine have, like, a lo-fi cat which was literally just Menchi sleeping, I believe. Stream. Stream, yeah. Yeah, so you could like hang out and study and stuff with. So maybe we could have a lo-fi Christmas tree stream. Yeah. Just sitting here. Okay. Just playing like I think those are, oh, hold on. I just on have one, one, oh, actually I have two. I have two little gnomes left. Yeah, I really like these skulls. The Disney ones are cute, but they don't really feel full, like, you know, match the motif of the rest are of it. Are you gonna skip the Disney's? No, I'm gonna put them up still. So. I have a couple of random, I think that we have, well, we have some Night Before Christmas ones over here, so that could kind of bridge the, the gap. Okay. Could thematically tie them together. Here's a impromptu question for the chat, because I, I, I do want to maintain some of this, like this semi-evil motif to us. Who is the most evil original Disney character? Uh, we have Donald Duck, we have <laughs> Goofy, we have Pluto, what about uh, the we have giant, Minnie, and we have scary Mickey. guy from Fantasia. He's super evil, and but he's not here. Traumatizing for a young child. I do think that Mickey, if you apply that sort of like uh, Matt Pat stylized corporate Mickey evil right. sort of character, yeah, he is. He has. He could be evil. He may be heartless in a way that's similar right. to Tulu. Um, I think that Donald Duck has an ornery side. I think that Pluto is just a dog. He's just having a good time. Here's and I think Minnie is bats. nice, and I think Goofy is is generally friendly. I'm gonna put uh, Donald and Mickey onto this tree. There's some more bats that's, that's going right. on. But I will look at the chat in a second, see if you guys strongly disagree with my take. I agree that of those, I feel like Goofy and Pluto are the purest. Yeah. Donald Duck has attitude, says Monalexia. Do Donald's got some momentum. He's definitely the most ornery, as Whoa. you said. Oh, here's here's a good one, guys. This is a, this is almost got a libel component to it, um, towards Goofy. Frey Iron says down. Goofy causes goof, Goofy, because Goofy does all these mean things, but pretends he doesn't know better. But he does know better. Oh my god. He just acts dumb, and that's mean. Is this like the Jar Jar Binks is secretly like a Jedi Master yeah, theory? Yeah, it's like Darth 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 Jar Jar. Yeah, Darth Binks. They should just make, they sort of like hinted, there's people on my TikTok at least, and that means it's official. Um, people who have hinted that there could be like, like with the Marvel metaverse thing where there's multiple timelines, that there could be multiple timelines of the Star Wars universe. And this is obviously people who don't want to retcon the new movies. So they're trying to make the Mandalorian in a different universe. Is what I they're think trying that to do. makes sense. Right. I, would, but, I believe that. But they should definitely make one vector that confirms Darth Jar Jar. <laughs> that would be great. We could all use it's a little all Darth Jar Jar. Jar Jar. Yeah. That would be very interesting. I wonder if Darth Jar Jar had been bona fide true, if people would liked it actually, or if it was just a thing that people liked. Because the whole like fan demanded things in Game of Thrones didn't really pay off. No. You know, a lot of the things that end up being true were sort of weak. Okay. Chat. Let's see here. Uh. I'm not sure people are happy about the Goofy theater, uh, Goofy theory. Um, <laughs> They're like, no, you're There's people wrong. that are going to bat saying Goofy's a good father. <laughs> you know, Goofy. Goofy has, is a good guy. He's a good guy. So you know, I, I don't. He's know. a good man. Leave okay. him alone. Leave Goofy and my son alone. Don't don't talk to me or my or Goofy ever again. Helen says that Donald played Scrooge. That's true. But Scrooge has a a positive character arc. That's true. Acting. <laughs> it's called acting. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All yes, right. going okay. to bat. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it's called Helen, acting. Not me. <laughs> um, let me think. Okay. That was pretty good. The thing is, Wait, though, can with, I have? Uh, there's one more skull left. Yeah. Well, the thing with Donald is he plays Scrooge or Scrooge-esque characters all the time, though. Like in Ducktales, he, he's essentially but is Scrooge. that I mean, Donald or is it just extended Donald relatives? Because like, what about those three ducks? The two, those three little ducks. Right in Ducktales. Right. So, there but is, is Scrooge McDuck? It's not Donald. Uh, it's his, like, it's another relative. No, I think that he is acting. It's a persona, right? 
What, what you're trying to say is which so is So every alternative duck besides those three ducks are just Donald in like a costume? I don't think so. <laughs> That's how they do it though, to be fair, in the Muppets. Right, like how many different things has Gonzo right, played? Right, but it's very clear. Gonzo was Charles Dickens. <laughs> it's very clear in those scenarios that it is that Muppet playing that character. Uh, chat, I, I don't have to make a poll, but you guys give me your thoughts. <laughs> is that Donald? Do I, you agree with me? Uh, yes, actually, no, I make vote. A poll here, okay. Uh, was Scrooge McDuck actually Donald? <laughs> <laughs> He's actually making a chat. Yeah. Yes or no? Yeah, okay, ask the chat. All right, answer, a, answer the poll, guys. These are the questions that we have to answer in this in this stream. You know. It's fine. You guys can say it's whatever you want. I don't care. A poll. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I typed it right. I'm oh, so paranoid did. that this poll is going to have some weird autocorrect on it, and it's going to say something terrible every time I type on I it. I think I'm going to vote. But I don't you know what I'm saying? It's like Google Docs. I can't type anything on it. It just yeah. autocorrects. I can't write a full sentence anymore. Anyway, um, that was a good bucket tie. It was okay. Should we go to that bucket over there? That what, was, do, what else do you have in there? Anything? I got the I got the non-threatening. Show me the non-threatening Disney's. All right. <laughs> Here you go. No is winning out. Seventy-seven percent. Oh, he's a bona fide different character. I voted yes, just for fun. All right, JC in all caps, indicating that they've had it. Okay, says, it's his uncle. Okay, so, uh, got it. <laughs> but, or, or is that just a confusing, like, not Mandela effect, but like a confusing thing? Because isn't, don't a lot of people call Scrooge uncle in general? Not a lot of people, but Scrooge has a nephew in A Christmas Carol, so everyone calls him, he's Uncle Scrooge. Right. But is it definitely Donald's uncle? No. I was like, <laughs> These are the questions that we need to ask. Yeah. Listen, did Scrooge McDuck character assassinate Donald Duck. Or the Duck family. Right, in general, right? But because doesn't he end up being like, good? He is good, yeah, no, no, no. The Christmas Carol is a positive arc. Ali, you said the Duck Dynasty, that's funny. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna put Daisy on I feel here. very underprepared I'm putting the other ones. Stream, actually, guys, because I don't know the full lineage of the, the Duck family. Okay. But isn't Scrooge's whole whole vibe, regardless of who, who he is, whether he's Donald or not, just redemption, like a redemption arc? Yes, he needs to so, be, yeah. So, I'm just saying it doesn't really matter if he's Scrooge or not. He's basically just so In fact, without mortality. Scrooge, he might be more evil, because then he's just got attitude. Right. With he's no just, redemption he's arc. He's just mean. He's just, yeah. he's just angry. Can we, all, can we all agree that The Christmas Carol is the most terrifying Christmas IP? Like, I, I was, I was, what do you think is scarier than The Christmas Carol? Because I freaked me out as a kid. It's loud. Okay. The Santa Claus, as in like the, the contractual agreement. Because This one? He just died out of nowhere and everyone was fine with it. They are, everyone's very <laughs> casual. It's so loose, like what if I was Santa and I died? There's a weird scene though. <laughs> there, there's a weird scene where they imply that Santa like has died, but has like moved on. But they show it briefly, you know what I'm saying? They, they, well, he turns he, he waves, in. he waves. Right. Santa, when he's dead on the ground, waves. So it's almost like he's he gets to retire to like the other with the Easter he, bunny he and turns, stuff. He turns into like air, is what happens he if you think about air. it. Yeah. Because his suit just deflates. Right. It does. Yeah. yeah so it's not like he so was he a might person. Have teleported somewhere. Okay. So this is another I, box. I, I will say I do think the Christmas Carol is scary, specifically because of the tall hooded ghost of Christmas Future. Yeah, that okay. one always creeps. Yeah, goes of really scary. The future me. is terrifying. Yeah. All right, do we want to do this one stuff and one more? We will. We have our live stream. We should. Yeah, we should do it. We should do those ones. Both. I say, should we do those like two at a time? Because we have one more box over here too. Oh, the ones really? from last week. Oh crap. Yeah. We should do two at a time. You can do this. Oh, well, one. the ones from last week are questionable. <laughs> <laughs> um, you, you saw them. You loved them. Here are last week's Christmas hack ornaments. In the flesh, well, they're in the bulb. In the bulb. So we have these ones, which I'm sure we didn't do right. Well, these ones are actually this one. This one looks awesome. Look at this guy. Look at his, the brim of his hat. Yeah, he looks. He's got like attitude, actually. That's, that's attitude. Attitude. I thought you said attitude. I'm not that clever. Oh, well, I said it. <laughs> I said um, it then. You said it. We also have this one here. As you guys recall, we did such an excellent job blowing the ink around in these things. I don't think that one doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look bad at all. It could certainly uh, be worse. So we have an assortment of those ones. And Sophia, what do we have over there? We have, these are like, I would say the pinnacle of Carly curation. Okay. We have sort of themed items. Like we've got a lipstick here, a little lipstick. 
we have like an overflowing bowl of something being mixed, which is really cute. We have a kettle oh. to represent the kettle of death that oh, has that the ended the stream <laughs> a time recall, or two. If you recall our pasta stream and how it ended in the middle, Yes, it was the kettle that destroyed the power the power breaker. We have some uh, Nightmare Before Christmas ones, um, and then there's also a there, there's an Adams Family one Whoa. attached to Zero here. And they're tangoing on this thing, Sophia. Kind there, of. Well, no, it, they're they're, they're, they're caressing each other somehow. There you go. I like this. Um, so you have Adams Family. I like the cousin it. Oh, that's yeah. excellent. That one's really really cute, and then um, I like also there's a few more down here that are really cute. I like this Alien Man. Oh yeah, that's a hardcore alien. Alien. Here's a bar of soap. Wow. I'm gonna put that in a box. Relevant. <laughs> Relevant. We're that to somebody. That's our scandal for 2022. <laughs> we put in the Frank, Frank and soap, soap giveaway. Give soap ornament. There's also a couple of these that I put in this box at the very last minute. These are like the ColourPop uh, Night Before Christmas like lipstick ornaments. Yeah. I thought they were cute. There are lipsticks in there right now. It is true. Um, and then I'm just, uh, there's also this mystery bag of Nightmare Before Christmas ornaments. I think there might just be one in there. Yeah, there's just one. There's yeah. one. So I'll see right now what it is. Um, I like that there is lipstick that's actually going to be hung from the tree, though. That Let's seems see. like a Should win. Should we see what it is? Which, Open which character it is? Yeah. Mystery bag. We got boxes. Boxes, boxes. and more boxes. Who is, who is that? <laughs> Who is this? I honestly do not know. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? It is a mystery. <laughs> it right, remains Chad, a mystery. Does anyone know? Is it on the bag? <laughs> does it say it on the bag? Of the 5,300 people watching, does anyone know who that is? <laughs> um, Apparently ours is rare, though. Oh. Great. Jack and Sally are common. Okay. Rare are this guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> um, oh, but it's Nightmare Before Christmas. It is. Okay. Is it one of those mischievous kids? No. No, those, yeah, they had masks. Okay. Well, we need to rewatch this movie, guys. Oh, also. Let's go frame by frame, and we're gonna see where this punk is. <laughs> I also have the dude in the throne. The literal dude in the throne. And his sidekick. Oh, nice. I feel like we could just rest on the hold, tree somewhere. Hold that, Like, hold last. That. And if you don't know, it's that dude in the throne, the one that's directly next to it now. That guy. It is one of the kids. Yeah. We're just going with it. It's Those a mystery. Guys, it's a mystery. Those guys scared me as a kid. All right. If I went back down, do you think I'll fall again? That movie was not really allowed to be discussed in my house growing up. Yeah, your sister's really scared of she it. She really doesn't like claymation, and so you can't talk about it. I was like, one time I was like, hey, Steph, have you seen The Fantastic Mr. Fox? It's like a pretty cool movie. It's claymation. She goes, stop. <laughs> I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> <laughs> Literally die. And I, and I was like, no, 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 you don't understand. It's kind of, yeah, George Clooney's in it. It's kind of funny. He goes, she goes, I really don't want to talk about it, actually. <laughs> Tyler, I don't want to talk about this it. This was like four years ago. <laughs> <laughs> so we don't talk about claymation. Yeah. I like it. A little soap man bar. The Fun soap man is a winner. I think we should just put it in one of the boxes. Yeah. yeah. You know? We've got boxes, boxes, so and more boxes. All right. I got Gomez and Morticia Lipstick. over here. Lipstick. Lipstick. Come on, come on, get on there. There you go. Okay, Lipstick. let's see here. Um, I did see as, because the chat, you guys are delayed a little bit. And as I brought out the DIY ones, I saw, saw oh no, not the DIY ones <laughs> as the first chat trickling in. I was hoping that yeah, those wouldn't be conversation here. Conversation about Scrooge. Defacement of our DIY ornaments. Debasement? I don't know if I, I, I kind of, I started a word and I just didn't really know where to go from there. So I'm just gonna start putting these guys up. Um, I do I do not want one of the DIY ones to block the Morticia. You just put them on the back. Gomez. Yeah. Put them on the back of the tree. No, 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 we need <laughs> them here, somewhere, up here. Yeah. Let's see, I, I think that these guys Man, we out. really have a full tree, this is good. Yeah. This is the kind of tree I like. Just where it's stacked. mostly ornaments. Yeah. I like a I like a, a degree of camp also to the trees. I like having mm. like I'm a big big bulb fan. You oh. know, like the almost like the um, cr oh. National Lampoon Christmas Vacation uh. type things. Oh, like a, like really oh. I like those. Yeah, they're fun. I was gonna say I kind of like cacophonous trees. Oh yeah. I feel like those have a little more character. Yeah. A little more heart in them. No, yeah. When you go really light with the su super aesthetic bulbs, then it's almost like you know 
What, what, you gotta be what, careful what? around the tree, etc. This kettle is about to take our stream down once more. I can't figure out where to put it. <laughs> it falls and just like hits Takes the circuit the whole breaker. Thing. Like you just watch like the surge go down right. and like hit the thing. It's like a Rube Goldberg machine, but it's just this kettle. Yeah. No! It's a very messed up Final Destination moment. Like what I, happened? I am somehow killed by this kettle. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That would be a plot twist. <laughs> People watching the stream just dislike. Wow. <laughs> just close it. Oh, man, I'm done. Um, let me see. I really like this little cousin. It. I really think it's. The tree's pretty loaded right now. Isn't that how he sounds? That is the sound. Okay. There's also. Jordan made some ornaments as well. <laughs> They're in the back. Yeah, so behind. Those white I'm surprised I haven't broken them by now. <laughs> yeah, those white bulbs are from... Those can we are take them out of the line of fire? You can. I feel like they're sort of being reserved as the final toppers, right? Uh, but we are rapidly... Getting to that the point. Good, ...the good real estate on this thing, though. No, but there is... That's what I'm saying, is that I like a tree that's full of ornaments, and less less tree, more ornament. Okay. So we can just cover it, put them wherever. Yeah, okay. Um, okay. Let me... I think... I can put some of these ColourPop ones kind of like around. They don't have to be like front and center. They're they're cute though. I don't think the heat from the lights will melt the lipsticks. No, that's crazy. Could be. I, well, well. Stranger things. Have now happened. that you say that, melt the lipsticks. I mean, not for. It won't be in here all the time. We'll move it after right. the stream. So we do have to get it out. All right. Nice shock. Is that what we're calling this thing? Is it? Is it shock? Is the name shock? Okay. Just put it somewhere. Yeah, I'll put you over here next to Cthulhu. I feel like you guys could be buddies. Cthulhu is kind of like a soup, souped up Oogie Boogie Man, right? Yeah. Much more capable of wielding fool and disaster <laughs> than the Oogie Boogie Man who can barely take down Santa Claus. Yeah. Right, exactly. I did like in Kingdom Hearts, the OG one, when you would. Oogie Boogie Man was a boss. So you got cool. to. Oh, that know, was too heavy. To... The lipsticks are a little heavy. Should I take the lipsticks out? Yeah. <laughs> Is this an ugly sweater ornament? It's a Seinfeld ornament. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> That's Festivus. Festivus. Festivus for the rest of us. <laughs> so we're gonna put these on and then we're gonna partake in the feats of strength. Do you have to drink a lot of beer and then stack them into a staff? That's not a real, that, that's, that's the pole vaulting drinking game. Oh, that's not part of Festivus? Yeah. No! Oh. That's a college That's not part of Festivus? Did you do that in college? Uh, no comment. <laughs> I don't even know how I, I knew about that. I, I actually don't know about that. Actually, I, I didn't say anything. What is the, the the premise? I think is you you have like a case of beer, right? You drink it, you put it on your head, so that's your helmet, so you can't see anything. And then you stack them all together. And how do you do it? Did you tape them? Mm, I I've never done it actually. And then you joust. So I can't tell you. I did it in when we were with my acapella group one time. <laughs> <laughs> I regret this paragraph, but no, but it's one of those games where like when I you- I regret opening my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I uh, just cut the stream. Yeah. You turn the music up a lot, Carly? Just like <laughs> blast it. Blast, blast joy to the world again. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but it's just one of those things where like, I feel like when you're doing the jousting thing and you win, if you slam like, you know, a stack of beers onto someone's chest, it's not like a, it's painful. Is what I'm trying to say. It's not- That sounds know, painful. It's not, yeah. So. It's less, it's more fun in theory, more fun in theory. Okay, that's a good Sally. It's a good Sally. This is a great placement up here. This is, this is, this is, this is now. In, is in, it a place of honor? In so it Final Destination, this is like essentially. like an, an appeasement to the kettle gods. <laughs> in, in Final Destination, death trying to get his revenge, essentially is just the air conditioner, right? That's essentially how it happens. He just starts the wind blowing and things happen. Putting this high up there is dicey. That's okay. great. That is great. Look at his eyes. <laughs> you can only see the little guy's eyes, like right there. <laughs> He's got some uh, sh sh show-stopping elements. Yeah, to him. he. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. All right, give me, give me something. Here you go. Oh, dude, dude and, and throne. throne? You, you did such a good job with the problem with dude and throne guy. is that he's heavy. He's really heavy. And that's why, as you guys Here, saw, he fell idea. off of the top of his snow globe. Here's a good idea. Our topper might be able to sustain something on top of it. So what if we put Dude and Throne on to top of our- Hot top? glue Dude and Throne? <laughs> Dude, no, that is literally a recipe for disaster. That will just take the whole tree down. Right. <laughs> Even just the topper sort of makes it <laughs> Okay, then I'll try and put a different spot for it. Maybe- Oh, is the topper heavy? Oh, well, 
a little, I, I put it on there and it was fine, but. Can you see him down there? For the sake of balance, we might actually have to start considering putting things on the back. Just like for like. Yeah, I have, yeah. I have some stuff. These things are pretty heavy, dude. I actually really like this. Did you one. see him? I miss showing him. Little dude in throne. Oh, he's hanging. He literally doesn't have a, he doesn't have a hook though. <laughs> Oh, 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 look oh. at him! But no, well, Jordan has a, Jordan has a No, look a at Dude and Throne. Oh, you oh. want to just leave him dangling? <laughs> oh, to turn him into a string? No, I think he can just sit you there. You like Dude and Throne as like an Alex Honnold, right? The guy that like free climbs without the ropes on? I literally have no idea what you're talking about, but <laughs> I'll say sure. Does anyone, I don't know what you're saying. You know saying. Who Alex Honnold is? He's the guy that like free climbs like Yosemite and stuff without ropes? No, okay. okay. Target audience missed. I don't know what you're <laughs> saying. I just... <laughs> Whatever. I did put the UFO back there. Yeah, I agree. It is very front heavy right now. I can put some of the, the thing is, is that these these guys are pretty light. I could put more of these plain ones on the back though. You could. You could. Uh, do we want to intro our custom ones? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, Tyler, do you have any more on your side or are you done? Uh, I have the topper and I have two more bats. Show me the bats. The actual bats. You want one? Show me the bats. Here you go. Show me the bats. All right, here you go. Oh, these. Okay, I can put these on the back. Yeah, you can put them in the back. These look like a uh, bar talk, from from um, Anastasia. From Anastasia. Is anyone else very thrown off by the fact that Anastasia is featured on Disney Plus? Because I no. always thought of Anastasia as a rival Disney movie that was not actually a Disney movie. Well, yeah. And now it's just like just they Disney bought has bought it. Yeah. They bought Fox. That's why. I'm just saying it's a sign of our times, right? You know. You can blame uh, show, where's Mickey? You blame Mickey for that. Yeah, where is Mickey? Just yell at him. I know you've been conspiring with Rasputin. Ooh. <laughs> Listen, you megacorp. <laughs> All right, chat, what do you guys got over here? Uh, okay, I think that's the guy I'm who like was free pleased. climbing in Philadelphia like 20 years ago when my mom was working at the Blue Cross Blue is Shield. This a, is this a really niche reference, Tyler? And you were trying to market it to Alex like Hom No, this. no, right here. People know what I'm talking about. <laughs> They're citing the movie that was about him. Yet, yeah, Michaela says, yes, Tyler, all caps. Okay. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. There are dozens sure. of you in the chat. Dozens. There are dozens of us. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, here we go. There's something. There was a. There was a chat that was blocked. There was something about Suck at Joan. Here. Uh, you should make a Suck at Joan one. Okay. Well, there is one. Everyone, just hang in there. <laughs> okay. Hold on. <laughs> Calm down. We have more ornaments coming. Do you think there's anything we should move to the back tie before? No. Let's bring out the customs. Okay. Yeah, and we can find primo placement with them. What could, time is it? I don't know. What time are we going to do this? It's for? been about an hour. Oh, okay, this is good timing. That's a full this stream is, already. Is... And we have more left. I literally am such a little frog on the floor. Like, I'm like half in shadow, too. I am frog with knife. <laughs> <laughs> Just down here. If you know, you know. Um, all right, so these are some. Um, Jordan, were these made with the cricket? Yeah. So basically, Allie and Jordan made these ornaments where they printed out some custom text and images right. and put them on these ornaments. So, start, start with that one. You guys requested it. This was preloaded. No, really oh my God, this is oh, so hot. No, <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is the thing that ignites the, 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 the tea kettle. Um, no. You put it, it right next to it and then I'll just burst into flames. Suck it, Joan, right here. Also, I like that it's, it's written with sort of like a, a very distinguished text. Yeah. Like, suck it, Joan. We're gonna be classy when respectfully, we say it. Respectfully, respectfully suck it. Suck it, Joan. <laughs> yes, that's Joan of Arc. <laughs> um, here you go. I know that last- <laughs> Oh my God, I told you, you literally did kill me. And I put suck it, Joan right next to the tea kettle. Wow. Yeah. That was crazy. Okay, here's the next one. I know that when, uh, I, I did go through the comments and saw you guys commenting on the new video, suck it, Joan. Apparently it's very blocked on any YouTube channel, so. It's funny that suck is is is, is so blocked. It's a no-no, yeah. So we might not want to spam that to the streamies comment section. And, you know, or, or. <laughs> Definitely don't, I'm just kidding. <laughs> and then this one is a fiendish behavior. Did you direct ornament. your live stream audience to comment suck at Joan on the streamy no, awards? Oh, <laughs> why would we never do that? I saw your shirt. <laughs> it's literally on your chest. This is really cute. I really like these ornaments from the cricket. Fiendish behavior. Hey, where was this? Where where, where was this man? He was it up was here. Up, yeah. He's right right next to Bartok. Right below. Wow, what a dangerous place, actually. Yeah. He'll probably fall again. It's yeah. okay. He won't make it out of the room. Yeah. How is he with the move? 
Also, you guys can't see it, but essentially the uh, the table we usually use is just jammed in the closet right next to us right now. It's, a, it's yeah. not even fully in there. It doesn't are, fit. We have rapidly outgrown this this office. It's really been the last week. I think I'm telling everything in the holiday season, just it, it just melts down. These, the, yeah, every every year. This no, happens. totally. Yeah. We actually got like the streaming sent us like that like package of stuff, and it was like actually this is this is the straw it, that yeah. broke broke the camel's yeah, back. Yeah, exactly. It's like we were doing well, and then suddenly we have an extra amount of things. It's over. All I can say is that it's a good thing we didn't do our candle idea, because it might have melted down the entire the Yankee candle. The, yeah, the candle. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. That might have. We'll been, wait on that. That might have. We been, need a bigger space for that. Yes. Here are two more. We have bulldozers first Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> which is the hamster, in case anyone forgot. And then I just blacked back in. Here you go, yeah, both of them. Bulldozers. That's me and the hamster. C could we have got, okay, oh, here, here, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. We have additional assets right now for the stream. We have, okay. This is actually, oh my God. This is actually a very strong <laughs> picture though of Bulldozer to be fair. Um, this is Bulldozer's first Christmas, which was. I really it's like. It's a very it. bizarre photo, actually, because it looks like. This, you yeah, cannot see Eve. him at all. And the, it just looks like a Santa holding. Holding like a crystal ball. Bulldozer's actually just a Santa that works at PetSmart in Raleigh. <laughs> <laughs> A hamster. Yeah. He's their hamster. Right, no, um, but I feel like... Um, I like this one because it looks like he's howling at the moon. Yeah. That's my favorite um, thing. It's one of the most dramatic looking hamsters <laughs> in history. This guy, it's like some evil mastermind over here doing something with it. Yeah, well anyway, so this was, you know, Bulldozer's first Christmas. Yeah, there you go. Bulldozer's first Christmas. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Jordan head reveal. <laughs> And then we have okay. two more of our customs down here. Let's see. Here, I'm gonna over here. I can see that the that the picture of bulldozer and the Santa is on the screen, so presumably you guys can see it. <laughs> um, Sandy the cat's a Santa doing some dark sorcery. Yeah, he's he's extremely ominous looking. I gotta be real here, actually. <laughs> here's uh, and then here's the last two I have. There's Hello Friends, and then there's the Krusty Silhouette. I don't know where this comes from. It's, Little it raggedy says, ear boy. Common nonsense, just in all caps, writes, Gulp down this failure, Jonifer. <laughs> so, <laughs> just a Is that trying to get around the Suck at Joan block? I know, I know that there were ways in which you guys were getting around the Suck at Joan block. Yeah, um, so. You put like spaces in between all the letters or something, or you yeah, change the yeah. S to the dollar exactly. sign. Exactly, yeah. You know. I will come at Suck at Joan. All right, so that's the Hello Friends. You want to show that to the big camp? I did. Oh, I didn't show the little bat, though. Oh, that's cute. There be a bat. There's a bat. Oh, it's really cute. And then home, we have the crusty ear. I showed the crusty ear, but you can show it again. Yeah. It's, it's worth it's worth a double show. Yeah, look at Oh, I love this one. You get you get you have even like there's like something with the cricket the way I was printing it, where it has like almost an accent on the edge there. Yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, yeah, because that, that's like his other raggedy ear. He has two raggedy ears, to be fair. One was He has the one that is indented. One is like missing. Yeah, we don't know which one, one was the one that was the signal that he had been fixed. One, right, that, yes. the, the clean one. Yeah. The other one's like an encounter with another cat, a raccoon, a possum. Hopefully not a possum. <laughs> okay. Um, a coyote? It could have been a coyote. I, I, I don't know if a coyote... It looks like another cat. It looks like another cat grabbed him or something. Yeah. Like well, yeah. Remember when we first were like uh, making contact, I think is the best way to put it with Krusty. <laughs> I was sleeping one time and I heard just like, cat noise in the street and I ran outside to see if Krusty was fighting off a raccoon or something like that. And I remember all the cats had skedaddled and then Krusty just like per perched up and walked over. He was like, okay. And then I, I, there was like some moment one time where like the raccoon was out back and I like came outside and kind of like did like a branch, like a threatening pose to the raccoon. Cause the raccoon would come and eat the cat. Food. And I think that was actually one of the imprint moments from Krusty where he was like, okay, so this guy, he will, this guy will look out for me yeah. out here. So yeah. All right. I think that's pretty much the ornaments, right? I think so too. Should we do a, a, a couple pans of this guy? I'm trying to think if there's anything else. There's no other ones that really need to go on for me. I mean, all basically put every ornament that Carly proposes on this, it's, except for a couple of the plain black baubles. I, it is a decked out tree. It's, it's got, and it's got a lot of the Nightmare Before Christmas vibes to it. Like this guy's got that zaniness. There's a couple that, that are a little Tim bit- Slight Tim zaniness. He's got the big eyes. A little concentrated, like yeah. I kind of, I want a little ham in some areas, but. Oh, you know, we have actually have the topper, so. That's oh, the I'm... topper. Right. The topper. Oh no, Sally, come back. Oh no. Stuck See, I changed one Joan. thing and then I'm just gonna basically 
<laughs> Shuck It Joan. There's a lot of there's a lot of Joan workarounds going on. Here. Well, Shuck It Joan's a great one. Shuck It Joan is excellent. Also, Shuck It Joan. I I do think we should maybe make we'll a it out. like a corn chowder shirt. We're gonna uh, actually our next merch item is corn chowder. <laughs> Shuck It Joan. <laughs> it's just corn chowder. Right. Yeah. Exactly. So. Okay. Great. You have the topper. You have the topper. Yes, I do. So the topper over here is. Let me bring up the box so I can do a reveal here. It's a. Well, I, I think it's I think it's very welling. I think it's good. What do you mean? No, no, I'm just saying it's good. Yeah, yeah, okay. And Why are you have, lampshading the, this topper? I'm not lampshading. Okay, here we go. Booyah! We have this bat tree Get topper. Get that bat on there. Yeah. You want a place? You want a place? Oh, can I? Oh. I didn't know there was anything else in there. So, Carly, I just impale him, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. I look so greasy back here. I'm going to cover my face. <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> <laughs> and, <laughs> and googly eye guy is down. Oh, my goodness. Wow, this thing is, like, really. I, I, <laughs> I put it pretty low down on it. Pretty low, all the way all right, down. Okay, okay. I think I let go too fast. All right, that's what, we're going to have to replace. Right, I'm going to hold googly eye guy. It's okay. I have him. Yeah, but he's going back on eventually. Good thing I put Dune Throne way down, because that would have been bad. Okay, the, okay you know, the kettle. The kettle is so foreshadowing. The kettle? Yeah. Oh! Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> Me? That's so it looks, oh, go, let's go to the, the, the action cam real quick, because it looks- Oh! oh! Me? It looks like the bat is carrying the kettle right now. And look at me. <laughs> Trying to oh fly God. away. And, and this, oh, this, this is a good analogy here. So we have this ominous scene. And in the background, if you see, is Mickey lurking, right? Yeah. <laughs> Mickey goes, yeah. look at my grand scheme set up can here. We, can we get a, a zoom or a closer zoom? Or is that as close as it gets? Let's see. Let's see. We're trying to see. Can you see, can you see Mickey ominous? Ominous Mickey. Oh, my God. There he is. There he is. Look at him. Look at that. Or, or you could just say that he did this. it's just Mickey hanging out, he enjoying his tea, right? Somehow. Somehow this is his fault. Right. Okay, so what else are we doing here? So let's put, no, let's put the googly eye guy, because he's sort of a lighter, a lighter tone. Yeah, should we get, 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 get yes. Mickey out of here? Okay. I think the chat is reacting to some of the, uh, the disasters that happened. Yeah, no, Jen R sees it. Lol, Mickey lurking. Yeah, Mickey is just right there. <laughs> I'm, I'm moving Mickey down a little bit. Yeah. He just—he does not deserve a place of honor. His Woodward, all caps, murder Mickey. Yeah. Yes. You know. Yes, like the ones I from the love, vintage stores in Japan. I would love to see Disney embrace Mickey as a heel. Right. Right. I mean, come on. Like, is Mickey's brand alive and well? Like, no Ooh. one's like, oh, I gotta watch the next Mickey Mouse movie, right? We're all in a Marvel or another. It'll things. be kind of like a season of the Real Housewives. It's like, yeah. okay, so we really need to juice up the storyline a little bit. So, Mickey, you need to get out there. <laughs> you need to accuse you gotta... Donald's. Uh, Daisy's husband of money laundering. <laughs> right, right, exactly, right. That makes perfect sense yeah. because of the Scrooge McDuck angle. Exactly. His uncle, maybe, whatever. If that's the, real, the, the case. The real housewives of Anaheim. Right? And then we can have him throw uh, a drink in Mickey or in Daisy's face. Yeah. Yeah. This all works. This is good. You what know what? With the askew bat, it looks just like our Franken cake. <laughs> oh. Right, because it's just like it really. Yes. It's just tipping its hat. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so. Should we do some some pans or something? Let's get some action pans. Some action pans. Give us some. I I think it looks great. It's oh, up. let me. I think Sally got turned around. Fold the top. Fold the top. Oh. But I don't think that'll help because it'll. It's not like it's going to come off this way. This is funny. Someone says oh, don't oh, ignore fold? the chat, and in the video while well, they said said that I was literally reading the chat. <laughs> I think they mean fold it and then put the. Oh. Uh, so that it's like two. This is what the chat. Okay, is take saying. it off. Take it off. Take it off. Oh, oh. with oh. this. Wait, right? no, no, do me a favor, Ty, take it off. You don't like that? No. You don't like that? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, take they, it off, take oh, it off. oh, 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 Fold oh. it first right. so it's a bit sturdier and then. Two handed job here, Safi. Let's do it. Ready? Yeah. Coming in. Okay. And then. Oh, yeah. Okay, that, that looks better. Now it's just like a tiny, <laughs> a tiny stuff. No, 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 no. Here's the real narrative this is not a bat, this is the mare. Of Bat Flavor Town. It kind of looks like this oh, frosted Fieri. tips. This is Guy Fieri. It's it's Bat Fieri. It's Guy. <laughs> it's Nocturnal Guy. Right. Yes. Exactly. Bat Guy. Yeah. Bat Scary. Yeah. <laughs> guy Scary. <laughs> the only the only X factor is that can can this guy still be seen or is he gone forever? All right. Let's Little see. Man. It. No, he's so <laughs> so in the weeds here. Hold on. Oh. Oh yeah. 
He's just peeping out over the branch. Just peeping, truly peeping. Where did Mickey go? Mickey went further down. He's, uh, well, he's there, he's there, he's here. Oh, he's got a good spot there. Well, he's got, now he's upset. He's like looking away. <laughs> <laughs> just like, how been, could you do this to me? He was disgraced by the chat, yeah. Wow, yeah. Yeah, that's not a good omen. Okay, well. This be our tree. This is our tree. This this is our tree. A Christmas tree. People like Bat Fieri. Bat, Bat Fieri? Yeah. Bat Skiri? So. This, this is the tree. Do you want to do a pan now? Yeah, let's do a pan. We'll do we'll, we'll do pan, and I'll, I'll I'll watch the pan on the monitor. And there's the bat. It's at the top, and then there's a little guy in the kettle, and then ooh, here's a lipstick, and there's a Sally, and there's Mickey looking away. Sally's enormous, like really there's distinct, some, a lot of some color. Gnomes. Here's right? a mixing bowl. There's a crust silhouette. The crust silhouette's a winner there. There's Dude and Throne. Dude and Throne somehow still hanging. Soap. Soap Hello is friends. a winner. Soap is a subtle winner. Skellington, ColourPop, more gnomes. Hello, that one's friend. also looking away. And then Bulldozer's Last Christmas is at the bottom. And <laughs> I just... Last oh, Last Christmas. <laughs> oh. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sop was just thinking more of the George Michael way, <laughs> right? Where it's, you know, Last Christmas was great, but now it's getting better. You know? <laughs> Bulldozer's Last Christmas. Cut to the image of him in the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Bulldozer's not here anymore. <laughs> this evil Santa has imposed... <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm gonna uh, turn some of the, the gnomes around. Nintendo asks, do you still have the key to Flavortown? Oh. I still have the key that they gave me for our, our wedding. Oh yeah. Do we still have the keys to Flavortown? So we, we never received an actual key. No. But I think we it was implied that the key exists in our hearts. I feel like we can, yeah, right. It, I, that doesn't, I that like, doesn't mean I don't want an actual key. <laughs> no, yeah. If you have a key to Flavortown, we'd glad we receive it. And we'd love to go to the restaurant. My parents really like <laughs> just the bloody trail off. There. Yeah. Listen, guy, if you're watching, uh, just ignore <laughs> everything we're saying right now. We we love you. We we want to come to the restaurant. <laughs> hey, guy. <laughs> hey, I guy. know we don't know how to pronounce your last name, but <laughs> that's like uh, Drew Gooden's intro. Hey, guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so well, I was gonna say something. Much, saying, that's pretty much the tree. Anything else? Happening? Oh, you know, S Sladia, nineteen says lights off. To start to get like the oh you right. want me to do like a dramatic off and on? What, what, what if we hit that switch? Has anything happened? No, don't do that. Wait, no. wait, oh you mean lights off in the room? Yes. Oh, I thought you meant lights off on the tree. No, 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 leave the lights on. No, let's just try, let's try the one. Jordan, you want to see what happens if we turn that one off? No, uh, probably not a lot. Here, it's okay. I can do these ones right here. Yeah, try both. <laughs> no, nothing. No dramatic on. <laughs> um, let's see here. Let's let's. Hey. Ready? Yeah, you want to turn them off? Yeah. Okay. Oh, we leave that one off. Okay, cool. Ready? All right, guys, if it gets dark here, you know what? Yeah, we're doing it. Yeah, ready? Might as well. And we're just going to stream this now. This Wait, that is one right there, our holiday season stream. Oh! oh it's dark. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, that's sick. Yeah, that's let's do a pan. so cute. It's, yeah, look, and Sally really stands out. This bat ornament right here is winning. Where is, can we do a nighttime pan? Look, look at look pan? at Mickey just still just shunning everyone in the chat. All right, let's 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 do one more pan of it. Yeah, this is a good idea. Yeah. You can see our our main guy right here, googly He's googly eye guy. Very visible. Evil kettle, lipstick, Mickey shunning everyone, Sally, little bats, little gnomes. Um, here there you have the mixing bowl, mixing bowl, crusty silhouette. Um, who, I kind of forget. Oh, there's Dude there's in Throne. Dude in oh my throne. god, you can see him. So <laughs> concerned. <laughs> Soap, Hello Friends, Jack Skellington, Color Pop, and Bulldozer's first Christmas. And also, I blacked uh, back in What's Happening. You're right. Those, those have good symmetry. Yeah. Given what happened. Yeah. Okay, yeah. great. Uh, All right, that, that's cool. That's a stream. So <laughs> Here, we'll turn the lights back on. We'll come back. We'll turn the lights back on. Yeah. So, oh, look at this weird half light. <laughs> Excuse Let me. Let me turn this one on here. Excuse me, sir. Okay. I thought that was pretty good when it was the light this was off. Also. That was that was good. Uh, Sid asks, "What about a Merkin ornament? That you know, they're a hard, Merkin ornament. They're hard to come by." Um, I think it would ma mainly be a Merkin <laughs> hey, with let a me string just, on it. Let me just produce one right now. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> it wasn't cousin it all along. It was actually the Merkin. Cousin Merk? Cousin Merkin? 
Well, yeah, there you go. All right, this so is just cousin it's slander. This is a merkin. <laughs> there he is, sentient merkin. Well, we learned a lot here today um, about hanging ornaments. Yes. And whether or not, uh, about the duck family tree. Yes. Um, as we did say, if you want to check out that little sneak preview in our next video of our next video coming out, yes. it is somewhere in the streamies. I don't know if they have any like timestamps in it, but it's kind of a, a fun little sting, and so you guys will know that we're doing something with bobas. It's gonna be a fun video. We're working really hard on it, actually. So it hopefully... literally kicked our ass this weekend, like completely. Yeah, w hopefully like completely. <laughs> Christmas Eve or Christmas, uh, hopefully. And if not, then it's coming out soon afterwards. Um, but yeah, that's sort of what we've been up to. Uh, I think that we did. I think this is a great assortment of ornaments. I think we got to take. Yes. Keep a lot of these. I think long -term. Carly did a great job finding us some ornaments, Amazing, and yeah. Jordan and Allie did a good job making some ones as well. Yes. So this tree is good. It's got a little. I bit declare of it good. A lot of stuff going on. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good tree. Declared good. It's a good tree. Uh, I would say that the fact that our ornaments from last week are on the back also makes it good. Yes. They're on there, but you just can't see them. We, we, we don't need those ornaments. We yes. don't need those. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yay. Christmas tree. Now we have to figure out literally how to get this out of here. Yeah, it's going to be a deal. <laughs> yes. We have to somehow transport this tree into the main room. Hmm. We probably should undress it somewhat. We'll figure it out. It does separate into parts, so we could just... <laughs> just each hold a part. Yeah. Just kind of like parade it in. That's a possibility. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Although it is, there are lights on there. I know, it's so dressed, right? <laughs> I like Julia says, I had to Google what a Merkin was Dumb. and immediately had to clear my search history. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> yes. Uh, awesome. Well, thanks for hanging out, guys. Yeah. Have a good time. I you, a, you already said we learned a lot here today, we, right? Yeah. So most uh, people are gone already. They go, all right, <laughs> see you later. That's a sign off. Okay, well, anyway, so here are our social media handles. Um, let's see. Yeah. There we go, Sophia and Tyler. And we have, here's our TikTok. We also have a uh, YouTube Shorts channel. If you don't go to TikTok, but you still want to see our short form stuff that we're making, we were filming a bunch of it. The thing that I drank today will be up sometime, sometime this week or next week. <laughs> um, but we got a lot of fun shorts that we have actually like sort of loaded up that we're going to be filming yeah. today and next week going into the end of the year. So that'll be fun. Yeah. Yeah. And other than that, um, 28th, no stream. But we'll we will remind you guys about that. see you guys next week on Normal Tuesday. Normal Tuesday. Normal Tuesday next yes. week. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, thanks for hanging out. We'll see you guys next time. Hope you liked our tree. Oh, yeah. Hit the like button and the subscribe button. <laughs> 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 oh, it's not out yet. Okay, yes. You can also like and subscribe. <laughs>